Hi, I'm Jack Cush of the Baylor Research Institute, and I want to talk to you about the results of the ACTION trial and the influence of seropositivity. This data was presented at the 2015 ACR meeting um, by Alan and, uh, uh, and colleagues, ASTRACT 551. Uh, and the ACTION trial is a prospective two-year trial to look at retention and tolerability of biologic naive individuals receiving abatacept. Uh, and in this particular trial, they did a, a retrospective analysis of, of those, um, of the outcomes of these individuals, especially with regard to their um, serologies. They looked at rheumatoid factor and CCP and divided patients up into either patients who are single positive, double positive, and those who are negative for either of these. Um, in general, uh, better responses, clinical responses overall were seen in those who were seropositive. You can see on this figure, the first um, block of, of data looks at uh, rheumatoid factor and uh, positive and negative individuals showing that um, with Boolean remission as, a, as the outcome, you have almost a threefold higher rate of remissions in those who are seropositive. Um, the same was seen with CCP in the, in the middle panel. And on the right, they compared double positives to single positives to double negatives. Turns out it doesn't matter if you're single positive or double positive, about the same results were seen. But in general, a two to three-fold higher rate of responses on these very superlative responses were seen. The same was seen in other measures of response, um, including low disease activity and ULR responses. Um, this is one of several trials um, with this particular compound, abatacept, showing a link to seropositivity. Not surprising in that we've seen this sort of same behavior with rituximab, but uh, interestingly, we have not seen that with the TNF inhibitors. So there's something unique about these other MOAs, these other targeted therapies, including abatacept and rituximab, that may um, guide us further as to who should receive them. Uh, an interesting uh, line of uh, investigation that merits further uh, discussion as to actually how this happens and what are the influences that lead to better uh, responses in those who are CC positive. That's it. Tune in for other abstracts and presentations here at TRED.